Hi guys, it's Retro Deep Gaming. Got on my retro t-shirt. And today we're reviewing something very special. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the game gear people. Okay, here. There's a better look at it. It's just game gear right there. The Sega, you know. Um now today I'm gonna be reviewing it took six double A batteries. What? Six double A batteries. That's um uh, a lot. Okay? But I guess it's worth it. Here, let me show you the gameplay. Can you see? Can you see good? Probably not good. Now the cool thing about this is you can turn the contrast up and down. Now the only game I have for it at the moment. Sonic the Hedgehog 2. Now, you know, it was, this game was pretty cheap. 750. That's a pretty good deal in a pretty good game too. Uh, now, the controls are one, two buttons. Um, you also got the start button right here, and your normal up and down pattern, or whatever you call it. Right here, you got your volume, and right here you got your brightness. And right about here is the on and off switch. Now, when they first released this, this was a big deal, but apparently didn't sell well. Why? I don't know. Do you? Because I sure don't. It's a good game. The Sonic 2. It's also a pretty good system. But. It's a but. Those six AA batteries that you bought at the time, would be drained two, four, five hours. Now, why? Why exactly? Well, this was made in 1991, and back then, they didn't have this much color, and this was just like, took a lot of memory, took a lot of power, took a lot of whatever, right? So that's the reason why, that's the reason why it didn't sell well, I, or I think, like it was pretty good gaming system, uh, but, I've seen, I've seen Nintendo 3DS's, I've seen Game Boys, I've seen Game Boys. Colors. Never have I seen a system this good, in, which was released in 1991. Yeah, that's a So it did pretty good. It was it was good. You know, because back in the day, we were like, holy guacamole! This is color. I'm like, I believe the um, Game Boy. At the time, it was not colored, and they made a video, um, actually taunting the Game Boy, <laughs> uh, it was pretty funny, where it would be like, spinach cream green color, and you showed the Game Boy, and then showed 
um, the game gear is like beautiful color, and it's pretty cool, but, is it good? Is it worth your money? Now I got my copy, well, not copy, but I got my game gear, yes, this is original, um, for $150. Now, I guess that's a good deal, but anyways, I'll see you next time. Peace out.